Craig Olson, uh, Baycare Orthopedics, um, reverse total shoulder. Kind of a new, up and coming, trendy uh, thought for taking care of arthritis in the shoulder, especially with patients that have maybe had previous rotator cuff problems. The real value of the reverse total shoulder is for this population who has had rotator cuff disease. And rotator cuff surgery, rotator cuff problems is, is epidemic in our society. But we know that patients with rotator cuff disease ultimately, not all, but a large percentage will have osteoarthritis of the ball and socket joint. Before I get into any of the, uh, the fun anatomy of why it's a reverse, um, it's really an engineering problem. And I'm a chemical engineer before I um, came to orthopedics. Really takes a mechanical problem of how the shoulder works and figures out how to mechanically give it leverage that it didn't have before. And really what happens is the shoulder is a ball which is on your arm side, your humerus side, and a socket, which is your uh, glenoid or your scapular side. And so the reverse really changes that orientation to where the socket gets a ball and the arm bone of the humerus gets a receiving cup. And what that does is it shifts the position where the center of motion takes place. And what it does is it changes kind of the fulcrum point. But if you ever have a very large, long lever and you have a boulder in your yard that you have to move, you realize that a very heavy boulder can be moved with a very long lever. And it really comes down to the engineering of changing that center of rotation, which is what the reverse total shoulder does. We've recently started using uh, advanced scanning techniques like MRI and CT to generate custom blocks that help us to do the surgery more accurately and more proficiently. The reverse total shoulder is so much more proficient at restoring the function and the motion than the total shoulders we did in the past. And a reverse total shoulder has really given us a new tool to really restore the anatomy, restore the function. Obviously the anatomy that when we restore it is reversed but restore it in a way that gives them function and gives them quality of life. But it is a very satisfying procedure and to see those patients in the office year after year is very enjoyable for me.